Good morning, good afternoon, and evening, wherever you may be. We welcome you to this session of the BNI Franchising Webinar presented to you by George Barlow, Director and Head of Global Franchise Development. George leads all global development, which includes new country development, as well as sub-franchise development. He oversees the screening and recruiting systems, as well as updating the annual franchise disclosure documents and ensures all compliance guidelines are followed. George has spent the last 21 years in franchise development and leading high-performing teams. Without further ado, here's George Barlow. Hi, everybody. Uh, we are just so happy that you're here today to the BNI Franchise Webinar. And we're going to start here in just a few seconds. But again, we want to welcome you to this webinar today and glad to have each and every one of you here. So let's just go and get started. Again, welcome to BNI. Uh, BNI is the largest and most successful referral networking organization in the world. Uh, we were started by Dr. Ivan Meisner back in 1985. And what he did is that he created a process and a platform where business people come together in a structured networking environment to build strong relationships. And it's been working extremely well over the years. So when, when you look at through the years and through uh, hundreds and thousands of members, what has happened is, is that it, they have experienced positive business growth by adopting the philosophy of giver's gain. And it's a proven method by giving and receiving referrals. And what is giver's gain? So it's be willing to give first before you expect to gain. And uh, what this has done is that by giving unconditionally to others, that support builds positive relationships and trust. So it's all about the law of reciprocity. It also creates a desire to reciprocate to the giver. So now we have seven core values, and it all starts with giver's gain. And that's the fundamental uh, core value of who we are. It's what we live and breathe every single day. Be willing to give first before you expect to gain. So uh, our other core value is building relationships. So it's building strong relationships. And what that does is that that creates an environment of trust and support. Also, another one of our core values is lifelong learning. It's always about learning and growing. And if you invest in yourself to become the leader you want to be, then that's what you're going to be. You're going to be a great leader. Also, another one of our core values is uh, traditions plus innovation. Uh, we honor our traditions, kind of what we've done in the past, but we look forward to the future, you know, innovation as far as uh, new technology and the future that fuels the innovation and the optimism. Also, another one of our core values is positive attitudes. We find the good in everybody, in, in everything. Also, accountability is that we do what we say we're going to do. We keep the promises we make, and that's real important. We really live by that here at BNI. And also recognition. We appreciate the recognitions. Uh, we really recognize everybody within BNI from the top all the way to the bottom, from the bottom all the way to the top. So these are our core values. This is what we live and breathe every single day, and it all starts with giver's gain. Now, we have a, a vision, and we have a mission. Our a vision is changing the way the world does business. Our mission is to help members increase their business through a structured, positive, and professional referral marketing program that enables them to develop long-term meaningful relationships with quality business professionals. And some of those will last a lifetime. Simply BNI helps businesses grow. That's what we're about. We're helping businesses of all sizes grow and we enjoy doing that. Now we have support centers all throughout the world. We have support centers, our global um, office is in Charlotte, uh, North Carolina. That's where our global headquarters is at. Uh, we have offices, of course, in uh, Paris, France. Uh, we have in Bangalore, India, China, Singapore, Ireland, uh, different parts of India, um, like I mentioned, um, Sri Lanka, uh, look at the uh, Netherlands. So these are all of our global offices that we have. Uh, BNI is growing. We are in more than 70 different countries right now, 
I think we just added our 71st and 72nd country. So we continue to grow and expand, and hopefully we're going to be in a country near you soon or probably in your country as we continue our conversations. We proudly support over 283,000 members, and right now, um, over 10,000 chapters weekly. And I'll explain to you in just a few moments about what chapters mean, but uh, we support over 10,000 chapters weekly and over 283,000 members. That's pretty powerful. That's what makes us the largest referral organization in the world. So back in um, early 2020, uh, we moved everybody to online. So uh, we still are online. Uh, we have moved to some hybrid models. So some are online, some are in person, but uh, we are still growing as we are meeting and, and inviting and adding members to each chapter around the world uh, online. Now, this is what a proven agenda looks like in our weekly meetings. Uh, just to give you uh, how the structure works is that we will meet on a weekly basis. And uh, before I go into the meeting length, let me talk about the meeting sizes. So the average member size in, I'm in the United States I'm, is about 25. Uh, internationally, outside the United States, it's about 40 members per chapter on average. The meeting length is about 90 minutes in length, and they either meet over breakfast or probably in the afternoon. Again, many have been meeting online, so it's about 90 minutes. And each member has an opportunity to give a one-minute commercial, a background about their business, their services or products, and then another member will give a 10 or 15-minute uh, presentation. And then the magic happens is the, re is the referral exchange. So the referral exchange is the most critical component of the meeting. Uh, the time is allocated specifically at each me meeting for a referral exchange. And that's where um, everything starts to happen and the results come into effect. People join BNI for the growth. So it's not just a networking, but it's a networking with structure, a proven agenda that works and helps people to increase their business. So that's how it's been working for the past 36 years. Now, let me just describe to you a little bit about what a chapter is like. So we help businesses big and small, and they rely on BNI for new sources of revenue. So businesses of every type and size join BNI to generate new business uh, and long-term clients. So this circle here represents a BNI chapter. So when you look at this, there might be one real estate professional in this, maybe a residential real estate professional, maybe one accountant, maybe one mortgage, but BNI members enjoy category exclusivity within their chapter. So it's only one business in there. So a category exclusivity provides members a competitor free environment. So again, this represents one chapter and there can be many chapters throughout a city, but this represents again, one chapter, maybe one accountant, maybe one dental office, maybe one real estate agent, maybe one tax accountant, maybe one therapist. Again, this represents one chapter. Now, the foundation for growth is networking and it starts there. You know, it starts with networking, then it leads to referrals and then referrals lead to growth. Uh, in a global study, over 90% of business leaders agreed that networking played a role in their success. I want to share with you uh, more about referrals. And this is a study that was done and it showed that 82% of small business owners had said their main source of new, re new business is referrals. Uh, referred in customers have a 37% higher retention rate. The lifetime value of a referred customer is 25% higher. And conversion rates for referrals are almost four times higher than any other marketing channel. So that's pretty powerful. Now, I want to talk with you a little bit about technology. And we believe in not only where we've been, but where we're going. Technology is very important when it comes to referral networking. 
So we have created an app called BNI Connect, and it's staying connected to your network anywhere. Uh, the BNI Connect mobile app helps you to connect with people all around the world to help grow your business. So uh, we have this thing, thank you for closed businesses. Um, we have a referral tracker on there uh, where you can set up one-to-one -one, uh, meetings with colleagues um, in your area or around the world just to talk with each other. So it's a pretty nice app uh, that keeps you connected. Um, also, too, we have a, a BNI Business Builder. And BNI Business Builder is, uh, it provides you access to mentors, um, other business professionals, and a whole host of courses throughout your BNI life. Uh, so you can uh, continue to learn with BNI Business Builder. There's membership success training, there's online management training. Uh, we call that BNI University. There's opportunities to improve communication and selling skills through participation in chapter meetings. We have monthly newsletters with um, educational materials on networking, public speaking, and a general business skills uh, training. So BNI Online, uh, meetings start every week on different days of the week. So some start at 7 a.m., some start at 8 a.m., some start at 9 a.m. Whatever your region is doing or whatever your chapters, they set that those times. And uh, let me just share with you uh, how this has been working and then how you expand your network. Let me just show you this. So making BNI work for you online, this is exactly how it works. So this is you right here. And you really can be connected to hundreds and thousands of people very easily. And how that happens is because you know a few people and these people know a lot of people. So because you know a few people, then you are connected with hundreds and literally thousands of people. So BNI Online has been connecting people all over the world. And it's just a powerful tool in how it works. Now, this is a picture of some of our great leaders, our master franchisees, and they are also called national directors, and they're in more than 70 different countries, and hopefully you can be pictured here one day soon as one of our great leaders. Now, why do people associate with BNI? Well, let me just tell you, and this is where people start to put check marks, is because of visibility across the globe. That's why they associate with BNI. He increased business opportunities. That's why they associate with BNI training and education, a proven business formula, a use of the company brand, dedicated hold hand holding process where we walk with you every step of the way, and an exclusive territory. So that's why many people uh, associate themselves with BNI. Now I'm going to share with you an ideal uh, prospect or um, someone that we look for to become a national director, to become a master franchisee. We look for someone who has an entrepreneurial outlook, uh, someone who has a sales-oriented mindset, someone who's motivated to help others. That's extremely important because it's about helping others. If you remember, we talked about giver's game. Someone, I would say, who has the sparkle in the eye and the fire in the belly, uh, someone who's open to new learning experiences and willing for ongoing development. Someone who has networking skills. You definitely have to have a network within your country, your region in which you're going to be serving. Uh, possess leadership ship qualities. Uh, they have attention to detail. Uh, has management and uh, organizational skills. Has good presentation and communication skills. And probably above all, someone who has the intention to embrace the BNI brand, the tools, the systems, and the resources. That's really important. So that's who we look for um, as an ideal profile of someone becoming a master franchisee. Uh, again, someone becoming the national director for their country. Now, we have an eight-step selection process. Now, um, I say eight steps, but there's quite a few steps in between. And the first step, of course, is you getting to know BNI and us getting to know you. Of course, you know, that goes hand in hand. Uh, 
step two would be attend a chapter meeting. Uh, have a chapter visit. And some of you have probably already done that. Uh, some of you are probably already a part of BNI, and that's fantastic. But if you haven't, then I'll get you connected with a chapter uh, that's near you, um, maybe a neighboring country. Step three is that we would discuss the pricing structure. Uh, so we would dive into that a little bit. Uh, we would uh, dive into talking about the GDP per capita, the population of that particular country, the small, medium-sized businesses in that particular country. We would also uh, take a look at uh, some of the urban populations. So we would talk about that. You would help me out with that a little bit as well. Step four, if everything is still moving forward, then we can begin the application process and we can start diving into the profiles. Step five, uh, we'll uh, move into final pricing and then we'll talk about talk about um, development schedules where we would um, uh, look at the country growth over a number of years. So as far as growth, so we're talking about grow to 100 members in year one, 150, year two, 250, 300, 400, so forth and so on. And then if everything checks out from that point and we're still moving forward, I'm going to invite you to step six to a VIP day. Well, you'll do a business presentation of your plan and moving forward, and you'll spend about two hours uh, with myself and my team, and uh, we'll just get to know you a little bit more, but also you'll be presenting your business plan. Step seven, we'll move into the FDD, which is the Franchise Disclosure Document, and we'll do a background chat, check if everything is uh, cleared up on your VIP day and we want to move forward with you and you want to move forward with us then we'll um, continue that process and we'll do a background check. And then step eight, after everything's checked out and you want to move forward and we want to move forward, then we can sign agreements. So that's kind of how the process works. And we can talk about that more when we get together, maybe on a one-to-one -one conversation or face-to-face -face conversation and dive into this individually. So let's talk a little bit about the time frame to develop uh, your country in which you're in. Uh, many franchisors talk about working in the business, about not working in the business, but working on the business, where we're kind of opposite. We start working you in the business first, and then uh, we'll start working you on the business. And what we mean by that is for the first six to eight months, uh, we'll help you build your home region and you'll learn how to launch chapters, learn to support chapters, all that good stuff, right? And then moving to month 12 to month 18, that's when we start working on the business. So we'll help you and train you to recruit your leadership team, uh, coach them to launch chapters, coach them to support chapters. And then getting to that year two or 24 months and on, that's when you'll start really going into sub-franchising, looking at regions that you want to sub-franchise and support. So identifying who are those prospects that they can do what you do, but in their particular region within your country. So that's kind of how the, the time frame all works out and working in your business first, and then you start working on the business. Hopefully that makes sense. Now, some people think success looks like this on your left. That's what people, I mean, that's what some people think, right? But what success really looks like is what's on your right. You know, it doesn't happen overnight. Uh, Dr. Ivan Meisner, uh, this is where, where he is today. Uh, he's on top, but he didn't start there. Uh, he had to start at the bottom. And um, he had to go through lots of different things. And we like to call this the trial and error minefield. You know, he, he designed something to see if it could work out. I didn't see that coming. Boom, blow up. I had to start over. Oops, I didn't see that coming. Back to the drawing board, lesson learned. I'm not doing that again. So it just wasn't an overnight success. Uh, he learned as he went on. So he's been there, done that, bought the T-shirt, so to speak. So he knows where all of the minefields are hidden because he knows how to navigate through these different things. And that's what we've been doing for the past 36 years is helping people grow their businesses. Now, 
people have tried to create businesses very similar to BNI, and uh, there's really three ways, at least three different ways that, or excuse me, three different things that you need really in order to uh, do that. Uh, you need technology, you need tools, and you need coaching just to compete in this particular business. Now, some people have tried to build it. You know, of course, it takes resources, it takes time, it takes money. Uh, you need to maintain it and update it. Uh, there's going to be distractions, and guess what? It may or may not work. Some people have tried to buy it. Again, it's going to take money, time, uh, coordination of efforts. Uh, there's going to be distractions, and again, it may or may not work. But what people have been doing for years is leveraging it with BNI. Minimal investment, already built, ready to use, and uh, already proven, maintained, and updated with BNI's help. So it's been working all these years. Now, that's why people have been leveraging with BNI. Fast growth, confidence, full support, constant updates. So what is leverage? Leverage is having a relatively small amount of cost to yield a relatively high levels of returns. That's what leverage is. Now, talking about building a business, we have been helping businesses for years and years and years. And many people want to leave a legacy. People want to grow their businesses and pass it down to children or grandchildren someday. Or they might want to sell it and have um, an annuity. Well, Michael Gerber, in his book, The E-Myth Revisited, said, when you build a business that can thrive without you, you have put yourself in control of both your business and your life. On the other hand, if your business depends on you being there, you don't have a business, but you have a job. And we've been helping people to create businesses over the last 36 years, and it's been wonderful. So uh, hopefully we can help you do that as well. Now, I want to show you this, talk about solid growth. Uh, People have been growing with BNI, I keep saying, for the last 36 years, faster, with more confidence, full support. When you look at that right there in the middle where it says solid growth, that's what it's all about. So we have a brand name, but it's not just about a brand name. It's really about what's behind that name that's fueling that growth. So you talk about brand name, solid growth, you have to have a great operating system. You have to have service and support. And that's what it's about. So when you connect all those together, that's when you have solid growth. Now, BNI, what we do is that we provide and we direct. BNI provides you with the right tools and the specialized knowledge on how to use them, and this will empower you to multiply your results and reach your goals. BNI is the how to your why. There was this guy. Well, you probably know him, Tony Robbins. Uh, he said, if you want to be successful, find someone who has achieved the results you want and copy what they do, and you'll achieve the same results. You probably agree with that, right? Okay. So I might don't know if you've ever read this book. It's called The Art of War. It's, you know, it's entitled The Art of War, and it says, there's a quote in this book that says, those who are victorious plan effectively and change decisively. And I know that each one of you on this webinar today uh, have a vision. You probably have a plan where you want to be three years from now, five years from now. Uh, maybe you want to create a business where you can build it to pass it down to grandchildren or children someday. Those who are victorious plan effectively and change decisively. So. Let's just quickly talk about vision real quick. What is vision? Vision is a picture of the future that creates passion within you today. Um, I know some of you on this call today have passion within you, and it's going to look to the future and what you hope for tomorrow. Now, I'm going to ask you a question, the vision. What do you see? You know, but that's a rhetorical question, but what do you see? Do you see a cat or do you see a lion? What do you see? When you lay down at bed at night, imagine your new self. What do you see? The future you see is the future you get. 
the secret to getting ahead is getting started. And that was a quote by Mark Twain. The secret to getting ahead is getting started. Thank you again for your time. Thank you for your patience. Thank you for your attention. So what's next? So next steps is this, is that if you feel that you are interested, there's a QR code on your screen. I want you to take out your mobile phone. And if you'd like to continue to have this conversation with me, let's schedule a face-to-face -face meeting. Let's have a one-to-one -one conversation. So again, you can scan the QR code that's on your screen, or you can go to this website that's on your screen as well. Uh, you can go to bnifranchise.com, bnifranchise.com, and you can schedule a one-to-one face-to-face meeting with myself. Again, I thank you for your time today and hopefully looking forward to speaking with you again soon.